What's going on, everybody? Favorite vlogger. I got a question from Joey DK. Joey DK wanted to know, said, in your last video, you showed you had some type of gruesome, I use gruesome very lightly because it's not the word he used, uh, toe injury. And he wanted to know, how does my job handle stuff like that? That's actually a pretty good question because I was uh, afraid of this just about uh, two days ago, Wednesday actually. It was my kid's birthday. Um, over here in Denmark, uh, the situation with the medical scene slash your job is a lot different. I know like in the States, like you got like two weeks, something like you got two weeks of like sick leave or something like that. And if your sickness or illness is longer or takes longer than it's supposed to, they want to see a doctor's note right away. Over here, I was worried about that. But it's, it's, really, it's really more beneficial for the person that's hurt. Um, in the case of my foot, uh, three weeks ago, Wednesday, was when I had their surgery done. Now, specifically, uh, the doctor was saying uh, the time that I'd be uh, not able to be agile or to be mobile on my foot was Wednesday. Oh, excuse me, three weeks. I apologize. Three weeks. It's long over three weeks now. It's actually three weeks this past Wednesday. But there's something that's within my contract of my job, which states that if anything goes longer than that, my job, now I'm saying this so you understand, my job, mid um, it's them that have to get this information from a doctor. If I'm unable to work longer than what I'm supposed to be, so it's been three weeks, so let's say I go a whole month Let's say I go a whole month without working. After a while, my job is going to be like, hey, can we see some type of documentation, something that states, you know, how long this is supposed to be? I was panicking because in the States, it's, it's flipped. You, the, the worker, has to get provide. It's, it's basically the same, but you, the worker, has to provide documentation. Say, okay. My timetable looks like it's going to be even longer than stated by the doctor. If the doctor says three weeks, after those three weeks, you have to go fucking back to work. That's how it is in the States. But in a situation where you have uh, longering, I guess, pain or, or it takes longer than it's supposed to be and it hinders your work. For example, I work at a, um, the hill in Plukko Pak Fabriken. Basically a, a pick and pluck. But at the same time, I'm also, my job requires me to wear um, what's known as uh, safety shoes. I have to wear steel toe shoes. And that's, that's, that's just the rule. That's like, boom. When you work in this place, you have to have safety shoes. Because I also drive with um, stablers or hand trucks and lifts and stuff like that. So it's super important that I have to have that footwear. But, of course, with my toe all mangled up the way that it is, if I wear safety shoes, it's going to rub up against that sore, or, or in this case, this opened wound, basically, and it's going to prolong the healing process. So I hope um, that you understand what I'm trying to say, Joey. Uh, well, you say you're in Denmark, but you could be somebody that's just new or moving to here. So I hope you understand. For, for those of you that are in like Joey's situation, read your contract. If you get a job, first off, if you get a job, congratulations. Second off, read your contract very thoroughly because there are some things that are beneficial for you instead of you trying to panic like I was and like freaking out. And most jobs, like my boss is cool. He was like, okay, cool. Don't stress about it. You know, I, he, I called him. He was like, we miss you, man. When you coming back? I'm like, I don't know. I know I said three weeks, but this is taking a little bit longer than expected, you know, as long as you call in and tell them or, you know, you're not bullshitting them around. And plus, my doctors know I've basically called them almost every other day and say, okay, what does the timetable look like? That the doctor can't give you a specific answer. It's you, the patient, that knows your own body. So in the case of my foot, it's A, it's still hurting. B, it's, for lack of words, still leaking. So... You know, these types of situations, you know, I'm walking on the side of my foot. And if I wore safety shoes, I would ruin my feet and the shoes. So, Joey, just like I said, read your contract and you should be fine. So, 
That's it from Faye Vlogger. Hope y'all have a great weekend. Uh, I got a lot of other like knickknacks and questions and stuff like that. I think I will address those, and you know who you are with that very bizarre question. I'll address those things at a later point in time. Right now, it's just not the best time to be talking about that. Okay, so we'll leave on a happy note. Guys, have an awesome weekend. Hope to see you in the next video. Please, by all means, like, subscribe, leave a comment. See you on the next video.